We are just two weeks away from the total solar eclipse, and safety should be a priority if you're planning to look into the sky on April 8th. As CBS 2's Steve Overmeyer reports, even though the moon will be shielding the sun, you still need to shield your eyes. There are few events in nature that can unite us in wonder, like the celestial ballet of a solar eclipse. The dance of the moon in front of the sun is not only a spectacle of beauty, but one that requires the utmost respect. The allure is undeniable, but so too is the potential damage. I actually think it's really important to be aware of how powerful the sun is. So what we're looking at is, in this image over here, is the actual damage of a patient that was looking at the eclipse in 2017 in New York City. That dark area that Dr. Avnish Deobakta is showing us is the exact black spot in the middle of this patient's field of vision, and it's permanent. It's almost as if the rays of the sun have almost burned sort of a spot on the retina itself, and then that part of the retina no longer functions. Eye protection will be needed for the entire eclipse in our area, even though 91% of the sun will be covered. So that's exactly why people, when they're looking at the eclipse, they get a false sense of security because they're not having the normal grimace reflex, but then you end up having damage to the retina and you don't realize it. The patient actually looked at the sun for 20 to 30 seconds, but did so with what she thought were protective eyeglasses. This is where the largest manufacturer of NASA-approved solar eclipse glasses are being made, American Paper Optics. You want to have safe solar eclipse glasses uh, that are manufactured to be able to look at the sun. Our safe solar eclipse glasses are essentially 10,000 times more dark or let less light in than a typical pair of sunglasses. Do not try to look at the eclipse through your phone camera or a telescope or binoculars. And beware of fake solar glasses. The real ones say ISO 12312-2. You don't even need to buy them. Libraries are handing out eclipse glasses for free. This is a life event. This is not going to happen again in the U.S. for 20 years. This is going to be the single most bipartisan moment of 2024, I can promise you. The most bipartisan moment. I love that. Check out our website where you can find out where to get those eclipse glasses, plus details about traveling to see the best view, and even a link for the state's eclipse playlist. It's all at CBSNewYork.com.